And welcome back. This is Baller Scoop with an episode of Let's Play StarCraft 2. I'm joined as always by Jim right now. I'm getting too damn old for this. For me to be putting eyes on your ass? Yes, yes, you are. They're telling me to go over here to the Protoss tank. Are they going to show me something a little different? I think so. All of the containment and reinforced structural integrity theorems I've developed from studying the crystal are starting to, well, crystallize. I think we might be able to contain energies that once required human machines, or even manufacture structures capable of hot landings from orbital origins with acceptable stresses. I'm a sham. I haven't truly really learned anything from this crystal. I've just observed the smallest details from it and somehow wrangled a few tidbits from the crystal when the crystal helped me. I don't understand how Protoss can possess technology of this magnitude and not rule the known universe. Perhaps they simply don't want to. Last entry on this sample. I figured out where it is putting all that excess energy. It's feeding the Hyperion, subtly helping to power the ship, balancing out some of the more ragged systems. It's giving of itself, and has been since, it's got, since it got here. Swan is excited that the ship is running so well, but he has no idea why, and I'm not going to tell him. Thank you, Stepman. Uh, yes. You have a question, sir? Not really. You have anything new to say? No, so let's just check out the research console. I already got the uh, the 20,000 credits for the excess Protoss research. Uh, we have a choice today between the tech reactor or an orbital strike for the barracks rally point. Yeah, it's just barracks units, which I will admit I use a ton of infantry in this game, but no, give me the tech reactor. How do you not go for the tech reactor? The thing is awesome. Shouldn't I get an achievement for that? Whatever. Moving on, I don't care about the achievements too much. Let's head for the armory. Spider mines! What do you have to say about them? Spider mines belong to a very small category of technology that came from old Earth and survived the crash of the supercarriers. Terran Marines are infamously mistrustful, or famously, sorry, are famously mistrustful of the Spider Mines IFF sensors. In 2499 Tarsana Space, John Pictures released Spider Mines 4 Death from Below, continuing a franchise about Spider Mines that had achieved sentience and turned on their human creators. It was the last hollow in the series. Whatever. These things are very skittish. Those goofy mercs are still using vultures, can you believe it? Damn things are death traps, even when you ain't got people shooting at you. Careful now, Swan. My old vultures saved my skin more times than I care to remember. I ain't gonna listen to you trash talk a classic piece of engineering like that. Classic? I suppose you can call them that. Of course, most folks like a bike that don't explode on them when the repeller seals freeze up. Or the fuel cells start leaking radioactive waste. But hey, who cares if it's a classic, right? <laughs> no one likes a smart ass swan. Everybody likes a smart ass. Uh, yeah. I forgot Janer. Uh, sorry, Jim Rayner. Who the hell is Janer? Jim Rayner used to used to ride the vulture. That's probably why I didn't like him very much in StarCraft One. I'm like, ah, oh, he uses that thing. So yeah, you can upgrade the vulture, which is the last vehicle here. Uh, you can increase the mine damage, or you can replenish their mines. I mean, really, it's all about the mines, apparently. Um, 15 minerals per mine, and then you can get more. Let's see, what do I want to do? Fire suppression system, not too useful. Um, Firebats and Reapers, obviously not using very much of, but I am using the Siege Tanks, so I'm going to get... Wow. Really? It's only 75% less damage, but that that is a lot, and it's going to cost me all my credit, so I might as well go for that. Nice round number. So let's head... I haven't been to the Cantina yet. Yeah, talk to Tigus and Tosh. What's up? I gotta know. Just what was it went down between you and Mengsk? Seems you boys were tight once. I used to think Mengsk be a force for change. Fought alongside him right up until Tarsonis. 
That's where we crossed the line. By using Zerg to murder the whole planet. He left Kerrigan there to die because she called him out on it. Turned out he was just as rotten as the Confederacy ever was. Damn. You sure know how to pick your friends, Jimmy. The way you say that, it sounds like you're going to turn on me, Tychus. I don't like the sound of that at all. Mercenaries are so untrustworthy. Not like rebels and pirates, right? <laughs> right, of course. Do we have any new, any new mercenaries? Yeah, you're always business, Hill. You don't have anything interesting to say. Uh, no, we don't. Can't afford any of the ones that I haven't hired already, and uh, there's apparently no medevac or vulture um, mercenaries. Awesome! So let's watch the news. Emperor, much has been written in regards to the tragic fall of Tarsonis. Tolosky's investigative documentary, Imperial Dawn, even claims that you brought down the Confederate system by assuring Tarsonis' fall. I've heard these conspiracy theories before. But the fact remains, the Zerg invaded Tarsonis en masse, and no force in the universe could have stopped their onslaught. It was a very... terrible day. Tolosky's film highlights the seeming convenience of the aliens annihilating a corrupt government that you yourself spent a lifetime trying to overthrow. Millions died that day, and you speak to me of convenience? Yes. I strove against the evils of the old confederacy, but never with the object of personal gain. When I was called upon to take up the heavy burden of leadership, I did so only to ensure our continuing survival as a species. Striking words from the Emperor himself. Up next, Zerglings allergic to lemon juice, old wives' tale, or new super weapon in the fight for humanity? Old wives' tale. Okay. Let's head to the bridge then. Yeah, still not gonna do the arcade, sorry. Oh man, will I be awful at that. If Mirahan calls, I'm, I'm... I'm just busy. He doesn't want to talk to her. So let's go ahead and take on the next mission here. They put them in order for me so very nicely. So I'm gonna head to what they tell me to go to next, which is New Folsom. that was ever raised against Manx is pinned up inside those walls. We let all them prisoners loose, and he'll never know what hit him. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. Alright. This break open new Folsom prison. This sounds like it's going to be one of those non-production, just survival missions. Let's see if I can handle this one. Where's Tosh? I thought he'd be here by now. He already left the ship. I thought you... Sir, we have an incoming transmission. It's highly encrypted. Patch it through. Well, well. The infamous Jim Rayner. My name is Nova. We should talk. Now what would one of Meg's pet ghosts have to say to me? Tosh is lying to you. Get Tosh on comms. I'm sure he's listening in anyway. Encrypted or not. We Spectres be the future. You just couldn't handle it, little girl. Every ghost that became a Spectre has gone on a psychotic killing spree. The ones I've captured are held in New Folsom. Don't listen to her, brother. Help me bust the Spectres from New Folsom. And we'll bring down Minx together. Tosh wants to reactivate his Spectre buddies, using the substances you helped him collect. New Folsom is full of psychopathic killers. Do you really want to release them into the galaxy? i be helping you against Minsk. And my people will, too. She won't even join you. He's a psychotic time bomb. He'll be on your side, right up until he puts a knife in your back. This be the moment of truth. Make your choice. Oh, great. We got another one of these. <sighs> So we have a choice of helping Tosh or helping Nova. Help Tosh break into a new Folsom prison and free the Spectres held inside. Tosh will remain with you for the rest of the campaign, training Spectres for your use. Help Nova destroy the Spectre training facility on a Vernus station, ending the threat of psychotic rampages by rogue Spectres. Nova will teach you how to train ghosts. 
but she won't show in your cause. So we have a choice of her or him. So they both can cloak. They both can launch nukes. Ghosts can snipe, which deals 45 damage, and Spectres can do an ultrasonic po pulse, which stuns enemy units in the target area for a short time. I don't know. This is a tough decision. I'm going to go with Tosh. You should have told me what you were really planning, Tosh. But I'll take your word over Dominion Assassins any day. We've come this far together. May as well see it through. You've made a poor choice, Mr. Rayner. I knew I could count on you, brother. Now let's go and bust open New Folsom. Uploading New Folsom data now. Feast your eyes on this, brother. They're locked down tight. Nova must have tipped them off. We're gonna need an army to break into that place now. Even an army couldn't get you in there. But one man, one specter in the right place can find a way in. Then our progress is all up to you, Tosh. I'll push my boys as hard as I can, but they're gonna need your help to gain ground. Sure, you sit back this time. I'll take the lead and clear the way. Just keep sending troops to keep the pressure on, and I'll do the rest. There are two cell blocks containing military prisoners outside the main compound. If we break those open, we could probably count on help from the inmates. What else? There's a Dominion base right by the main prison entrance. Take that out and the guards will retreat. The prisoners can handle it from there. All right, Tosh. You ready for this? I've been waiting a long time for this. I'm ready. He hasn't uh, betrayed us yet, so I, I don't see why I should not trust him to this point. But, as I had done before with the Haven mission, I'm going to go and uh, do the other mission after this one. Breakout. Okay, so, I tried to rush it last time. Uh, this is the second time I'm playing this. Wow, no, go away. Hold on. Just need to make sure I was recording there. Okay, so yes, second time I'm playing this. I failed the first time because I tried to rush it. My cloaking abilities. I can take out all these guards. They'll never see me. Harry. Because uh, this is an incredibly I slow a mission. Explosion to take out groups of marines. A little trick I call mind blast. Okay, so this is pretty much gonna work out like a Dota. Pretty much they're going to send minions, and here's my hero. And just like Dota, this is going to be incredibly slow. That turret across the bridge. It can see me and alert its allies if I get too close. Even with my stealth, I do what I want to do. Just do it twice, takes those out. We can take this guy out. There are mechs that are going to come and heal me, so that's one puzzle done, I guess. But really, I mean, it's just a war of attrition, this one. Ah, crap. Okay. For this one, we're going to use the size shield. He doesn't actually say to use it. I don't understand why he doesn't say to use it. But we're going to use that. And we're going to run up and try to kill the missile turret immediately. Let's go! 162. You, see it? you can see it right there. And there we go. Hang in there, Tosh. My boys are moving in to back you up. Remember, just keep sending in troops, and I'll do the rest. Just I can't control the minions. That's the bad thing. I can't tell them to focus here, focus there, take that out, take this out. Nothing like that. So they kind of they're they're minions. They're stupid as hell. What do you want me to say? And they will die very, very often. No, 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 no. Yeah, take that guy out. That guy's a dick. Okay. I don't know. No. Let's wait for them to show up. 
Okay, then I can shield and try to take this out. I might be able to do it. It's going to be close. Down it goes, and I start to heal. Awesome. Mind Blast! Mind Blast! You guys can't hit me, I'm invisible! So I'm already doing this a hell of a lot faster than I did last time. Okay. Let's just go over here and hold position. Take out the tank. Start taking out the tech reactor here. As long as he holds position, he's fine. Ah, crap. I probably do need my help on this one. Go get the tank! Okay, got it just in time. Taking out the medic, which is the most overpowered thing in their army. You know, let me say medics are awesome. Oh, medics! Heal me! Okay. So now that I know what I'm doing, this is going a lot faster, but... It's still a very slow map. And there's not much to be done about that. Okay. So if I run this way, hit D, and I run over here, and I try to take that on directly. Down goes the turret, which is oddly enough what they're called in most Dota games, especially League of Legends, the damn turrets. And it looks like we've already solved one of the problems. Nice. Yeah, I'm just going to go for production let them take this out. Just move over here when we're done. Because... They set up base in here. Which is awesome. Okay. Oh, damn you. I'm sure it does hurt, actually. So, I usually like to do it from the Marauders because, you know, then they can start to be healed. Alright, this one... This one takes a couple times through. Alright. There we go, just got it. Didn't get too much damage. But... He is invisible now, so he can just hang out here forever. Die. Now get the get the SUVs. Tosh, you're nearing the first military cell block now. Let's go for the siege tanks. They're more important right now than the than the bunkers. I will go over there eventually. Pretty much, size shield to victory is the plan. Uh, splash damage on those damn things. I should be able to start taking this out. I want them to start moving down here, so I'm going to finish off these bunkers at least before I start trying to go for the extra credits, which are over here. Okay. Now, I can't go that way. Yeah, move over here. Okay. Okay, let's go back down here. Hopefully they can start to heal me. There we go. And I can consume you. Our allies are being attacked. Give me some more energy. Head back over here, try to mind blast again. What are you? 
Hammer securities. Okay. Alright. Let's go for D and move in. Try to take it on. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Couple more. Still in the green. Awesome. Take out the siege tank. And then we can head over here and rescue these guys. Which will give us uh, basically. Yeah, they'll give us diamondbacks slowly over time. Let's head back over here. Last you guys. And this is Dota. Pretty much try to get as many minions as you can. <laughs> uh, I'm not a big fan of Dota, if you haven't been able to tell. Okay, so let's hold position right there. Hold again. Consume you. And that's why I told him to hold position, but he did not listen. Okay. Uh, so here's the first one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for it. No! No, 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 no. So this is where I died last time, trying to rush it. There we go, just die. You guys, you guys coming? Where are you guys running, pansies? No, take him on. Ah, before you ever got a shot off. Right. Shield, just go for this. Alright, making a little bit of movement here. Hold position. Hit him. And hit this. Hit you. Okay, slowly but surely we are making progress. Dota is a war of attrition. Usually. Well, I've never seen a Dota map take less than like 40 minutes. Okay. And then I can hit this guy. Hold position there. Wait for you guys to get through. Nah. We'll go help out. Stay out of the circle. It's not that complicated. Medic. Medic. Yeah, the minions help out eventually, but not nearly as much as you would like. Sweet! They did it. So I'm just going to take that thing out. Stay out of range. Not enough energy. Not enough energy. Whole position. Taking out the tech reactor, which I did get the upgrade for, which is awesome, but we're not going to have a chance to see that this time. Alright, D, go! Get that! Alright, consume. There we go. I am overpowered! Sweet! It's about time I started getting overpowered. Yeah, they just keep pushing forward. Eventually they'll go back and take uh, this thing on. Down it goes. Keep busy while we establish our forward position. Can do. Our cell block B. Close to the second military cell block, Tosh. Feel like making some new friends? Don't you worry about us, Tosh. We'll keep them busy while you free the prisoners. Raven. Okay, so we can start getting siege tanks if I perform this perfectly. Hopefully I can do this. 
I don't know if I can though. Our allies are being attacked. Let's do this. Yeah, let's run back over here. I got one of the siege tanks, which is nice. Taking on the the special Viking, the Hell's Angel. Ah, damn it! They spied me for a second there. So I can take these guys out, which it looks like I'm gonna be able to do. Yeah, that's that's good enough. Let's go for the Raven. This one's a little tougher because it moves, but I should be able to do it. There we go. Seventy left on the shields. All right. Somebody get me a medic. We're doing better, but they, they're starting to get snipers. Got a nuke ready for launch. Paint a target. Just don't call the strike in too close. Snap, get out of there. Snap. Holy crap, I almost died. We got a nuke. Um, oh, I got four nukes. Jeez, okay. I, I don't think I want to use them just yet. It's still too early. Okay. There we go, there's reinforcements. I'll get out of there. I don't want to use a nuke here. I don't think this is the time. Ugh. Down goes that one. Not enough energy. Can I... I can. Sweet, I can come in here. Alright, this is definitely where I'd want to use the nuke. Let's use it... Let's use it here. I'll take out this, this side first, for whatever reason. I don't like the right side. And then we'll take on the nuke here. Alright, so I still got two left. I think those were two very good uses. I don't know for sure though. We'll need to see a little bit further. Sir. Sweet, I can somehow see that. See the siege tank. And then, where can I nuke? Can I nuke here? That'd be awesome. Yeah, right on top of that siege tank. No, I can't. Okay. Let's go over here. I don't know how far back they're going to push. So let's go ahead and help them out. And then we can consume that guy. Give me some more energy. And then... Help him out a bit there. We're getting close. I still have two nukes. Taking out... Taking out this stuff here. Taking out the banshees, which okay, hold position there. 
Where are my reinforcements? There are no reinforcements apparently. Yeah, I got plenty of energy. Just die. Alright. Uh D nuke. Come on, nuke! Get out of there. That didn't do it. <sighs> what the hell? Okay, you guys you guys can't see me. Do I need to take this out? I don't want to waste my last nuke. Let's, do this. let's go. Let's go there. There goes the nuke. Alright, took out the planetary fortress. Just need to wipe this stuff out. There we go. There. There's the infantry. Just waiting for you guys. Just go over here so a medic can heal me. Damn, siege tank. You scary. Alright, get this thing. If you guys could get the missile turret, that'd be awesome. I know you can outrange it. So I'm adding you because I, I probably didn't use them in the right spot, to be honest with you. Probably would have been better to use one here and then here. Um, but I did an okay job. Uh, now it's just the playing the waiting game. Waiting for buildings to destroy themselves. Can I have more reinforcements? God, you guys are late. Always late. Just come down here. There's no more missile turrets. You can help out with the siege tanks. They are doing good work on this factory. And then we can head up there when we're done. I have no idea what the achievements are for this one. I probably didn't do them because, well, this is my first time beating it. But, I think I did a decent job here. I'm sure some people will tell me that I did not, but I think I did alright. And down goes the stop port, and so we can head up here. They got Reapers! Oh no, they've got like three Reapers. Whatever shall I do? Huh, so that's what a tech reactor looks like when it's, like, falling down. Alright, we did it! We've liberated New Folsom! You just unleashed a nightmare on all of us, Rainer. Heaven help you now. And the wolves come tumbling down. Be free, my brothers and sisters. Your new life awaits. <laughs> Oh, sweet. I got two of them. Okay, so I got all the missions in less than 25 minutes. I beat it by like 25 seconds. Uh, oh. And um, I didn't help Tosh enough. But if I did that on normal difficulty, I don't think that'd be a problem. So sweet. Bonus credits. Everything done except for 100 life. Whatever. But I'm happy with that. Alright, where are we going to end up? Back on the bridge. So I bet there is a cutscene here. It's usually cutscenes on the bridge. Fifty years and no one's ever escaped from New Folsom. But we broke it open in an afternoon. I can hardly believe we pulled it off. guys did good. Now me and my specters have finished the job. We'll kill Minx and burn his dominion to the ground. Overthrowing Minx is just the start. This is about building a better tomorrow. Don't you see? 
We just released every scientist, philosopher, and free thinker that ever challenged Meg's rule. That was our real victory today. You really that naive. Tomorrow there'll be a new Minsk. And another one after that. Your great shining dream of the future is just an illusion. So if it's all so bleak, why are you here, Tosh? What do you get out of all this? Same thing as you, brother. I don't quit till Minsk is dead. Vengeance doesn't factor into this. Our revolution's about freedom. You'll see that better future, Matt. But it ain't for the likes of us. So every time they play a, a little cutscene after a choice, it, it makes it seem like you made the right choice either way. I bet I'm going to like the other cutscene better, but that one was definitely nice. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this part of Let's Play StarCraft 2. I've been Bala Scuba. I've enjoyed it as always by Jim right now. Standing around talking to my damn self. I am sitting down. Thank you very much. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.